LeBron James. Some say he's the best high school basketball player ever. You can't quantify that, but as we see James within the last 45 minutes arriving at a party at a hotel in his hometown of Akron, Ohio, respective areas, Carmelo Anthony in his Baltimore home, nervous about where he might be going, and Darko Milicic in his agent's office in New York City. As they watch, let's go to Russ Granick, the Deputy Commissioner of the NBA. Okay, thanks again, Mike. Now let's find out the real big winners tonight. The third pick goes to the Denver Nuggets. That means Cleveland or Memphis get number one. The second pick goes to the Memphis Grizzlies. And that means that the first pick in the 2003 NBA draft goes to the Cleveland Cavaliers. Congratulations, Gordon. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, so, well, we, we yeah, the odds, yeah, and it works. Yeah. That's I'll great. That's great. That's so terrific. Thank you. Uh, a couple of very different stories working yeah. here, Mr. Gunn. Congratulations. Thank you, Thank you. With LeBron James being from Akron, Ohio, I'm sure there has to be a lot of excitement in the organization. You know, we don't know who we're going to pick yet. <laughs> But at least there's somebody who you can just drive over and check out oh, if you'd like, you, right? Yes, I, I'm very glad about that. I'm, I'm very excited for the fans in Cleveland. This is a great day for them and for all of, uh, all of that market, for Akron, Cleveland, all of Northeastern Ohio. Mm -hmm. Tremendously excited about it. A big day in Cleveland sports. Well, congratulations, Mr. Gund, and Thank we wish you. you guys the best of luck. Gordon Thank Gund, you, Thank the you. owner of the Cleveland Cavaliers, and that Memphis pick now goes to the Detroit Pistons, so Detroit ends up a big winner here as well as they get the number two overall selection in the 2003 NBA Draft. Back to wrap it up and get you ready for Game 3 of the Eastern Conference Finals. Nets and Pistons coming up next on ABC. First, the GMC Professional Grade Plays of the Week.